All right. Yeah. Hey, it's Chris Homestead and Hardaway, and we're going to show you how to stop your chickens from flying out. And like most of the videos we do, we do stuff and say, wait a minute, we should have done a video on that. And there's some other people made some videos on. But the easiest way to stop one from flying out is to uh, is to trim their wings. This, I'm going to kind of, you have to use some imagination. You only trim one. That's important. I've seen other people make videos on and they trim both of them. You're not, I mean, you're reducing lift. That is true, but really the biggest thing you're doing is throwing off equilibrium. If you trim them both, sometimes a light chicken can still fly. Make sure you got your good pair of scissors, and it's almost a two-person job. But you find the bone, put your finger on the end of the bone so you don't cut the bone. You just cut the feathers off. You can see the difference. See the difference. Just make sure you don't cut the, the little tip of the wing bone. You can feel it. Just cut the flight feathers off. And like I said, I only do one wing. If you do both, sometimes you'll get fooled and they'll still fly out. Hope that'll help you a little bit. We I watched a few videos on YouTube, came up on my recommended, and kind of showed it being done wrong. And we had a couple we had to do these little white beggars with flying out. And we discovered that white chickens are very common outside the pen. They just attract everything. And the best time to catch them is after they roost. And, yeah, something you have to do at night. Our chickens aren't pets. And it's hard to get your hands on them in the daytime. But you can walk out to the coop, take them off the roost pole, turn their wings, and set them right back on it. And maybe it'll help you a little bit. And remember, you never plow a field to turn it over on your mind, in your mind, and I appreciate you watching.